Oh boy, are you excited? Because I'm excited for more World Box. And you know who else is excited? These elves. Yes, they are. Ah, uh, blah, blah. Oh, look, <laughs> they're already dying in gigantic piles of lava. Thank you, Volcano, for eradicating the elves. But no, my friends, no, no, no. We're not just gonna sacrifice elves all day. There's something else interesting that I wanna play. If I can figure out how to do it, I think it's right here using the Steam Workshop. If I browse world, I find North and South America. And I'm gonna play this world because it's gigantic and fun. Okay, that actually looks legit. Some of these worlds, <laughs> like, they can be real derpy. <laughs> like, it's North America. It's not even North America, that's just America. But you know which one's my favorite? This one, because I'm never going to give you up, and I'm never going to let you down, never going to say goodbye. Uh-huh. It's Rick Astley. And here's everybody's favorite actor eating a stack of pancakes. I don't, I mean, this is, this is a legitimate world that... I, I gotta just try it for scientific reasons. If I make water grow, can I just plant trees and stuff? <laughs> um, I don't really... <laughs> this is so dumb. This is what happens when the rock eats way too much protein powder. He just starts getting like weird little animals flying around his head. What is that thing? What are you? A waff. It must be a wolf. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of want to play with that level. I do. Because we have to gear up this entire continent. Also, you got a little case of the Venezuelas down here. And there is no trees. Why are there no trees? Let's plant some. Plant, plant, plant the trees. Plant them all day long. That didn't plant. We got one tree out of that. Seriously, plant more trees. There we go. It'd help if I made the right buttons. And we'll throw down a few hundred thousand rocks all upon the continent. And some gold nuggets here and there. Maybe eventually... And of course some silver. And because we have Hawaii, I'm just gonna slap a volcano on it. And somewhere right in here, Old Faithful will live. Yes, Old Faithful, the geyser. You know what that is in Yellowstone. So for my next trick, we are going to open up settings, click the button 11 times, open up the debug thing and click fast spawn. All right, humans, we're gonna, we're gonna do what we do best and take over areas and corrupt the environment. Spawn him. I have no idea how many I'm spawning in, but the world population is 478. So that's a good population to start with. So activate. Okay, they made a city. No, they're just spreading out. That's kind of cool. <laughs> they're all together. We better make sure the world's like got the right rules in it. Yeah, they get hungry. Okay, I don't want any rebellions. That should be fine. Everything else would be good. We can make them hungry, but I'm gonna make them immortal. Yeah, they can't die from old age. That's illegal. All right, population, spread out and make your cities. Now I'm gonna give you the super fast time. And as soon as this world gets polluted and populated, why is everyone going to Alaska? Oh wow, there's a couple different cities. I was not expecting them to spread out so well. Huh, interesting. And they spread out like crazy. Look at this, they're going up here in like Northwest Territories, making Hudson junk way up here. That's dumb. It's cold up there. Also, rest in pepperonis, Hawaii. It was nice knowing you while you lasted. Now the rule is that any time one city hits a population of 100, we're just gonna let it live. I was gonna nuke it, but I mean, there's much better ways to destroy an entire continent. Okay, they weren't supposed to be going to war and stuff. I thought I'd turn that off. Why do we always have to fight? Why can't we just have world peace? Like, you guys be friends and stuff. Work together for the good of humanity, you dorks. It's always a fun stage in the game where they start making boats. I remember when they first put boats in the game. Oh, look, a new city. This is so much fun. Why is there a palm tree where there's ice? It doesn't make any sense. You dummies are not supposed to be going to war. That's why I turned that on. You cannot declare war. Maybe I should let them. We want kingdom expansion. Okay, expand, no wars allowed. In fact, I might just erase all of these other areas and let this bigger country take over. I mean, that's pretty much America anyway. And that's what America wants to do is like take over the world, right? Oh uh, no, they're doing it on their own. I told you to stop doing the wars and stuff and you're still doing it, you dummies. I guess they're just doing it through kingdom expansion, whatever. Oh, they can steal borders too, that's fun. I also like how they made a port down here in like Nicaragua, but it could have been the Panama Canal. They just decided not to. And I don't think they can go around it. I think that's the edge of the map. So let's do a slight bit of modification and go swoop de doop de bloop de bloop de. And now you can drive around. Maybe. Maybe we'll make it deep water. There you go. Deep water. We just made the Panama Canal. It's a breakthrough. 
in science. Okay, can we make it through here? Is there a nice canal through here? Looks like it. <laughs> Why is Greenland so massive too? I feel like we need to throw in like a billion bears over here. Activate bear mode. Oh, I didn't know about this. If you spawn a bear in the snow, it makes it a polar bear. Aww, that one's crippled. <laughs> Oops, poor guy. So many bears. Oh, they're gonna die. Why are they, why did the game just freeze? Oh, did I break it? Real talk, does this mean I beat the game? Does it, I, I think it won. Oh, it came back. We're alive, my friends. <laughs> the thousands of bears crippled the game and made it destroy itself. Kinda wanna like put the bears just to walk over here. That'd be funny. But this will just prevent people from settling in Greenland. Where's my favorite tool in the game? It's called the magic eraser. Yay, removes all life with a single touch. So what I want to do now is remove all of the life from these other areas, like right here. And then once it's gone, then my favorite country will come up in here and settle it, I think. Yep, okay, so there's, there's no population there anymore. We'll just get rid of everyone here. Very good. And then they make a new settlement. See how that works? That's so nice. And then the Americans will take over the entire continent. I'm sorry, Canada. You weren't really that important anyway. Except for you. If you're a Canadian, it's a joke. I don't actually want to get rid of all of the Canadians. These guys are doing a really... No, you're not allowed to settle there. This is for the blue people. The blue man group. Whoop, goodbye. Oh, I just destroyed your entire army. Oh, I feel so bad. Just kidding, I don't. All right, we are back to only... Oh, never mind. We are back to almost having only one civilization. Somehow the game thinks there's three humans that live here. I don't see it. Maybe they're on a boat. Also, what's this? Why are there so many rabbits and turtles in the frozen island? Oh, <laughs> there's the king. He's over here on this boat, I think. Where was he? He's just hanging out. That's the king of the, the purple group. We're just gonna go boop and he's gone. All right, that's four. Oh, you know what? That might've been the king of the other group. I don't know where they are anymore. I'll just keep trying to erase them. Oh, purple people eaters, where are you? Oop, nope, that was a turtle. There's some more turtles. Okay, I don't see where these humans are. I keep erasing the turtles. Oh, probably one in there. Nope, that fishing boat did not have any humans in it. How does that work? How are there three now? I keep trying to delete them. Maybe they're hiding up here. Nope, turtles are gone though. I've spent the last 500 years of game time trying to delete the last two humans that live in this settlement. And I can't do it. Where are you? I need a person. Is that a person? Are you a person? Nope, that's just a flag going flippity flop. Everyone's just hiding inside. They're like, no, we don't want to die. Oh, that's cool, going through the river like that. Wait a second. No, these have blue flags on them. Where are the humans at? Wait, hold up. Why are you down here? Why is the king right here? And boop. <laughs> that should be one now. Okay, cool. I need to see where the last remaining person is here. The leader, Bushy D. Where are you? Why are you in over here, Bushy D? And boop. Come on, get erased. Okay, now, yes. Okay, cool. So <laughs> he was just he was just doing whatever he does in the other cities. Like, I don't even want to be around there anymore. People just get erased. And it seems like all of the bears died. I turned hunger off, I think. But that doesn't matter because there's a lot of chickens and stuff for them to eat and sheep. The king is also 801 year old. He did kill something as well. Is he level 10? He's level 12. Okay, we'll just give it a few more centuries of colonization and everything will be good. Nobody wants to live in Cuba. Let's make it a little nicer. Also, the Dominican Republic is just full of bunny rabbits. And because this is a North American video, goodbye Venezuela. And goodbye Greenland. <laughs> I didn't really like you anyway. Now, whatever this mess is, goodbye to you too. I don't know why I didn't do this before, but I feel like we should probably have jungle down here. Yeah, and then all the way through this, jungle time. And then probably Florida needs to be jungled too. And it'd be kind of fun to see if the jungle will actually spread across the map. I mean, Florida's kind of swampy. Oh wait, we should have done swamp instead of, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to destroy your buildings. Oh no. I don't really care. They'll just grow back. Buildings can grow if you didn't know that. Oh my, look at that giant army here. It'd be a shame if somebody were to, you know, a little, little bit of a boop and then, and then, oh. Oh, that's, it's okay, they, they mostly survived. It's fine, everything's fine. Is the swamp spreading? Oh, it's starting to. That's kind of cool. Wait, is this just water? Uh-oh. I didn't really want the water to spread, but 
I mean, that's fine. We could put some alligators in there. Yeah, let's go little alligators. Oh, vacation's just, uh, I mean, you're Florida man here. <laughs> Destroying all the alligators. But for my next trick, we need to we need to spawn in the flame tower. And I mean, it spawns demons and stuff, so no better place to put it than uh, right in Washington, DC. Cause that seems to be about where all of the demons live. Does it, okay. Wow, they instantly destroyed it. They rebelled against the demonic fires after it burned up half the country. <laughs> Fitting. And then they're rebuilding. And then I'm rebuilding. I wonder if it eventually spread and, oh wow. Okay, I mean, I wasn't really expecting it to survive this time. And now the demons are actually living. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, okay, they destroyed it again. I was totally not expecting that. <laughs> I kinda wanna do it a third time. I mean, that's what elections are for, right? Okay, just get rid of the, the demon creatures. I promise I won't do that again. Did the king die? Where's the king at? Hold up. Is this the... <laughs> Stop it! Why? Is... <laughs> He's got an interesting name that we can't pronounce without fear of demonetization. Is this the same king that we had before? I mean, he's got three kills now. Uh-huh. Uh, yep. 1,400 years old. He has the great amulet of terror, and he's got the shah of truth. Huh. I don't feel like that's the same king. I feel like our king died. They're just chasing around the demons living here in the deep south now. Oh, oh, now it's in the water. Does it die in the water? When 371 hit points? Oh, it does. Interesting. He's actually pretty strong. He's just burning up Florida and everything. Why don't you go over here where the army is? Oh, I think they finally got him. That's too bad. So now that everything has been properly rebuilt, we have to figure out a nice way to destroy humanity. I mean, a polite way. There's the Conway Game of Life. Sell your automation that does something with simple rules. Bring the destruction and the fun. But there's something else in here called, like, tumors. If I can find it. Why do you hide the fun stuff, game? There's the tumor. Grows on land and devours everything in its way. It burns very well. So let's start it down here and see what kind of happens. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Tumors are growing in Cuba. What about the Dominican Republic? Or Haiti? Whatever. Hispaniola. Is that the name of it? Hispaniola? I think that's it. Oh! They turn into weird little tumor creatures. Oh boy. <laughs> this will be fun. Now, Nufi. Is this Newfoundland? I feel like this is Newfoundland. Not exactly sure if it is. Maybe it's Nova Scotia. I'm not exactly an expert on Canada. I'm just going to use up all of these inhab inhab inhabited uninhabited. There's the word I'm looking for. All of the uninhabited islands. I'm gonna get a nice little tumor on them. Hmm, that's a very pretty pink color. It's killing all of the chickens. I like it. So it does seem that it has a very limited range, but it could be fun if I put it over here and see what... Oh, you can't put it on the mountains. What about if I put it here? Do they attack things? The little tumor creatures do. Oh, but they can destroy it. Interesting. They're like chemotherapy. I feel like I need to start down here. Just in the southernest tip of the world. Maybe. There we go. And we'll see if we can get spread this thing all the way across. Look at the little tumor creatures. Oh, there was a bigger one. Did you see that? What are you? Wow. He's immortal, weightless, ugly, gluttonous, and wise. Interesting. I don't even know what kind of creature you are. I kind of want to make you like super powered. That'd be fun. I wonder if they can have weapons and stuff. Okay, they just destroyed that whole thing. But somehow the, the tumor people got over here. Maybe I'll start it in Florida because nobody's living here. Good reason. They can't actually build anything here. Spread my disgusting little tumor creature. Spread, oh my word. <laughs> There's an entire army up there. Finally, they're spreading. It's spreading. This is working well. I feel like I should curse humanity before I do this so they, they turn into other weird things. It's spreading. <laughs> oh, they're attacking it back. That's illegal. You can't attack my thing. Oh no, there's a big old army. Oh wait, hold up. It looked like something's a ma magician down here. You see that? Somebody's got like a magic stick. It's not you. Somebody has a magic stick. It, oh, maybe it's just attacking. That could be it. It's spreading. It's totally spreading. Every time one dies, I just spawn another one in because that seems fun. 
Oh no. Oh, it's on fire. It's on fire. I don't like when it goes on fire. How do they know that fire is illegal? <laughs> it's working. It's working. It's also interesting that these little roads stop it. But if we put it on somewhere past the roads, it spreads really quickly. Like this whole area up here. Man, those little creatures just run out like crazy. It's still spreading. Oh, we got an army coming in. Are they gonna are they gonna defeat it? Nope. It looks like they're getting just ripped apart. Turning off sonic speed so we can get a little better picture of what's going on. That thing has weapons! <gasps> I think it does. I need to click on you. How did you get a weapon, my dude? Oh my word! <laughs> are you kidding me? What is this thing? It's got a flame sword of terror, adamantite helmet. This thing must have killed a king to get everything. A veteran, does it have the king slayer? It doesn't, but it killed something pretty strong. Oh, that's incredible. Yeah, get destroyed and stuff. Oh, it died. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I didn't realize that they could actually hold weapons. Oh, wow, arrows. Arrows are bad. Arrows are illegal. Wait, hold up. Hold up. What are these creatures now as a bow? <laughs> oh, that's so cool. I love it. I almost feel bad for the little army that's just hanging out down here because they are surrounded entirely by these weird things. Just doing everything you can all day long to just stab the tumors and hope they die. And then you just get destroyed by another creature from behind. Look at this little army of tumor slugs. Oh, they just erased that person. Never mind. They just went and hid behind a dead tumor. Oh, they can't go in the water, though. Interesting. What kind of a weapon did you have? A wild spear. That sounds fun. I should find the button where I pick you up and drop you off. There it is. Co oh, no, I want a copy. <laughs> Who's gonna get it? Can someone get the weapon? Yes! Oh, it just turned into one of those slugs. <gasps> oh, that's cool. Oh no, we have rainfall. I mean, no, we have fire. Let's make it not be fiery and rain on it. Oh, wow, we've taken care of half of the continent already. Sort of. Might as well spread some holiday cheer down here in Mexico. Looks like almost everyone's dead too. Oh, there's hardly any people left. Wow. Oh, it's spreading so fast down here. That's so cool. Yes, my precious. Yes, my precious. Look at the little nasty army. It's ripping through things. <laughs> oh, oh, they just took down a tower. Yes. Oh, there's there's like 10 left. Can they make it? Can, can the last of the humans survive down here in Mexico? They're actually doing a decent job of fighting back. But not if I have anything to say about it. Ooh, oh, wow, took it out. Nice. Good job, Rick. Uh-oh. Oh, no. There's like... Three people left. Oh, <laughs> I think he just attacked it. No, he's building up a new house. That other house wasn't nice. Oh, that guy just got just straight up destroyed. We got a bonfire. We got a bonfire. It's spreading. We have another house. <laughs> the little creature's like, no, that's my house. And there's two people left. Wait, there's got to be more in the tower. Are they, Can they make it? There's so many of them. Oh, oh the archer just took it down. Ha <laughs> ha. Yay, that city is, wow, whoa. Okay, we got fire again. Stop the fire, fire's bad. Somehow there's still a city of 36 people living here in the midst of uh, Tumorland. I have a really good desire to remove all of the roads and volcanoes and destroyed buildings. Oh, that destroyed the other thing, Never mind. I wanted to keep the tumors. There, ruins and tornadoes, that's the better thing. We're gonna destroy it all. We're gonna get rid of all of the rune stuff. There, that's beautiful right there. Here's another big battle going on. Oh man, it looks like as soon as they die, they turn into one of those creatures and then they get to keep the weapon and everything that they had. There's just so many of the creatures swarming in. Even if you've got really good armor like this dude has, you just die quickly because there's just an unrelenting swarm of the tumor creatures. Eventually they get overwhelmed or they do they just retreat. Yay. Is there one? Oh, oh, he died. He died. Where is he? He's right here. Let me see you. <laughs> That's so weird looking. He's like, I'm content, honest. I'm a veteran crippled 201 kills. Wow. And now he just lives his life as a tumor-ridden drone. Oh, and I think they are marching heavily into the human territory now, taking out buildings after buildings, beating and destroying. Wow, too bad a lot of these guys have adamantite spears. So you just kind of rip them apart. Oh, there's a big army going through. I'm just trying to find any little space over here in, in Alaska to put down the little tumors. Ooh, this is nice. There's so many buildings here, but like hardly any people. I guess that makes sense because it's Alaska. Quick, infect everything. It must spread. Humanity must not know about us. 
Oh, look at it spread. Look how fast it's going. The little creeplings just walk around and bonk into things, destroying buildings. Oh no, the little army's here. Oh, whatever should happen to you, little army. They're like, we will destroy everything with a vengeance. Just made up a dumb little song. It was pretty good. I'm excited about it. And then he gets eaten. <laughs> it's better that way. Resistance is futile. Actually, I think there is a board cube too, isn't there? Is that what this is? Yeah, simulate cybercore. We should do a cybercore. See what happens. Oh, they attack the other thing. That's illegal. I don't like that. You're killing my you're killing my tumor army. Oh, that's kind of cool because it does spread. And that thing is might be. Wait, do they have weapons? Are they just born with weapons? Are they just weaponized? Oh, because it would have been fun to give that to a human of some sort. All right, okay, I'm gonna nuke it. Uh oh, fire! Fire is bad with the tumors. Quick, put it out. We didn't start the fire. It was always okay. Got it. I kind of like this. The last of humanity is all congregated in their boats. <laughs> they're, they're just right there. All of the humans are just right there in their boats. So I'd like to clean up everything here. We're just gonna wipe through, clean it up, and then hit it again with stuff. Cause we don't like those roads. Roads are bad around here. Roads totally stop the spread of the fungus. Also the boats magically disappeared. I have no idea where they went, but I think humans are extinct now. So I did it. It would have been nice if there could have been some sort of civilization with the drones, with these things. I don't see any of them. I'd like to see one with a big beaten stick of some sort. You know, it reminds me of the Zerg in StarCraft. I wonder when StarCraft 3 is gonna come out. Is it ever gonna come out? <laughs> I summoned in a necromancer. I wanted to see what happens and they are dying. Goodbye, necromancer. Whoa, whoa, it's summoned in a zombie or a skeleton. Oh, they killed the skeleton. Did the skeleton give it something fun to play with? I wanna see if it turns into a, a creature. Ooh, more skeletons. All right, is it gonna die ever? Come on, will you just die? It's not even taking damage. <laughs> They're just chasing it everywhere. Oh, here comes another one. Okay, and did, did they get a weapon? No, they didn't. <laughs> well, my friends, that's going to do it for today's video of World Box. I hope you enjoyed me destroying North America. It was kind of an exciting time. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, let me know and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. I'd also like to give a shout out to all the patrons and YouTube supporters, including Spider Sax, Iffy Sphere, Joe B, Obi John Kenobi, Fury, Arrow, Doug Rules 2.0, Nerdy Geek, Alan H, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippius, Des B, Eagle Arc, Maxer, Whippet Good, Spencer T, Zarnoff, Deegan, Jason M, and Rail.